What's going on, my peoples and my peoples to be? This is your boy, Conrad Carr, back with another Get to the Point review. And I'm shooting with the Hero 9 right now. And that's because I'm going to need my phone to show you what's going on with this new item I got, which is the newer double handle camera mobile phone shooting bracket. It was too much to remember. That's why I looked down. But you know what? I'm too old to be ashamed. So let's get to it. It's very simple, let's just go through. There's only two pieces that come in the box, which is basically the cage and the little grip here on the side. So, got a little quarter inch um, knob here that can be put uh, to the side to actually make the double grip on the, uh, on the cage. All right, and it really is as, you know, simple as that, uh, you know. So that way, once you get your phone mounted, um, it has three of each. It has three cold shoes and it has three quarter inch screw inlets. And of course, on the grip here, it has a, uh, um, a third quarter inch screw male to put accessories on. So in total, you can have one, two, three, four, five, six different accessories plugged in to this cage at the same time. Um, it's primarily made out of plastic. Don't grab it too hard. I just flexed it real quick and it was like, I could probably break this thing in one twist if I was to handle it that way. But of course, that's not how you're supposed to handle this thing. If this thing was made out of aluminum, I would be like, okay, you know, yeah, this is a you know dope piece, but you know, it's made out of plastic. This is my first piece. I'll probably upgrade somewhere along the line. Maybe I'll see how much use I get out of this. This is my little GoPro light that uh, has a little cold shoe mount on the bottom. Yeah, so this, is, this would simply just slide in to here. And oh, that's, that's loosey goosey right there. That's not cold. Shit, I'd have to put a piece of tape. Look at that. that that's not cold. That, that's wow. That's way loose. Usually the cold shoes are, have a little more, uh, have a little more grip than that. That's not cool at all. Because if I was using the cold shoe for the actual GoPro uh, the GoPro mount and I put this thing in it's it's, it's snug like it, it's not gonna pop out but with this thing it's like I wonder I don't know I'm gonna have to check other accessories and see if they're as loosey-goosey as this but that's not cool all right my peoples I'm back I got my phone and we're gonna see what the phone holder is all about it's pretty cool because it has a little knob back here to lock it into place. I mean, usually the mobile phone holders, it's just, you know, they, uh, you know, they're all sturdy. Everyone I've used, even the cheap plastic ones that have, don't have a little rubber cushion on it, you know, they all held my phones perfectly. Uh, but the good thing about the newer is that the newer has a lock. So once you get it to where it's at, you can actually lock it to the place that actually super, super prevent it from uh, moving anywhere. So, um, and I guess another plus is that now you have something with these things, they're usually difficult once you have it mounted on tripods. It's kind of difficult sometimes to get your phone into these things when they're out, when they're not loose like this. But with this, <laughs> you can actually use the knob in the back to kind of push it up. So that will make things a hell of a lot easier. Mount that up. Lock it into place on the back. I probably could tighten it so much. And okay, and that's oh wait a minute now. Wait a minute, newer. Oh, I didn't like that. My phone shifted. That's not cool. This thing is supposed to be intended to, you know, for, for mobility. Let me see if I did it wrong. All right, it's still a little looser than I would like, you know, because you have to pick, do it a little off center so it's not pressing your buttons. Maybe that's what I need to do. Maybe I'll try to center it a little bit more. So apparently with this thing, you have to like really be mindful and get that phone in there. I mean, maybe if it wasn't inside my protective case, it would be a little bit better because I do have a case on the phone. So yeah. 
you you'll want to make sure if you got a case on your phone, make sure it's seated as far down as you can get it before you tighten it up. But you really got to get it in there because the rubber cushions are not flat. They're kind of at a, like a V shape, which is funny because no phone is shaped like that. Every phone is going to have a somewhat flat surface. So that's really an odd design to me for it to be like that. I would much rather have a cell phone holder with a C clamp like this as opposed to a V shaped clamp like this. I should have showed you before I uh, mounted this thing sideways like that, but you can also put this portrait mode like that if you wanted to, if you needed to, and, uh, and shoot like that. Now, I think I'm going to have to take back what I said earlier about the cold shoes being loose on this unit because actually the Techstar mic has a tightening bolt on it and maybe other accessories out there have the same thing so it will not slide out of this whereas the gopro accessories uh those i think are really intended to be used with you know gopro <laughs> accessories um but anything else your phone and cameras and stuff like that equipment you buy for that is more of a universal thing all right yo this is your boy conrad car from the get to the point reviews thanks for checking me out like subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.